deficit disappeared because of good market conditions at the end of the 90s, before you know, 9-11 and, and what followed, uh, the plant had generated substantial returns above the assumption that the actual buy in 1991 or 89 or whatever the McKenna years were uh, when I looked at this. Uh, so if more money had been put in before, less would have been put in after because you're always aiming to get to that funding money. Now if it had been put in and those extra companies would have made up top of that, then yes, there would be more money. How much more I have not calculated. Mr. Minister, also, that I guess from a, a taxpayer's point of view, there are obvious other ways of creating revenue for the products other than just taxes and transfer payments. I think such things like automobile insurance. A few years ago, a big study was done, insurance rates were adjusted, something was mentioned with regard to a provincial government um, insurance act like Saskatchewan has. We don't have to go to Denmark to find a solution to this problem. Because approximately $50 million in premiums, after all settlements have been made, are going out of this province to New York City, to Toronto, to Geneva, and yet our, our province and our leaders do nothing to address that, follow a wonderful role model of Saskatchewan, and institute a provincial government insurance program and keep the revenues in this province and then again I wouldn't be standing here today.